Happy Friday, Team Seymour. I'm Staff Sergeant Carly Smith. Today's June 30th, and you're watching Strike Eagle News. Don't miss the Independence Celebration happening tonight at 5 p.m. on Langley Avenue near the Fitness Center. Admission is free, and festivities include a live performance from country singer Kyle Jennings, along with food vendors and, of course, a fireworks display at 915. For more event details, visit sjfss.com. And in case of rain, the concert will be moved to Heritage Hall and begin at 7 p.m. And the fireworks rescheduled for August 25th. Summer is a great time to get outdoors and enjoy the warmer weather. However, it also brings with it multiple safety concerns. Staff Sergeant Ethan May from the Wing Safety Office tells us how we can enjoy our summer while staying safe. Hey, I'm Staff Sergeant Ethan May from the Wing Safety Office. Now, I know everybody's looking forward to the 4th of July and having some time off of work, but there are some things you should keep in mind to make sure that it's a safe and enjoyable time. First off, if you're planning on firing up the grill like I'm sure a lot of people are, then be sure to always use your grill outdoors and away from the house and any other combustible materials. Now, if you're planning on using fireworks over the 4th of July time period, there's some things you should remember to stay safe. First thing is alcohol and fireworks never mix. If you're planning on having something to drink, then make sure you stay away from things that go boom. Also, never let children play with fireworks unsupervised. I hope everybody has a fun, safe, and enjoyable 4th of July weekend. Airmen from different career backgrounds are getting a chance to see what it's like to be a SEER specialist as part of a new SEER augmentee program initiative. The program trains augmentees to assist in mandatory SEER training for pilots and other flyers. It's pretty much a win-win for us. Um, for the most part here at the SEER shop, we're a two-man shop and usually we only have one man here, so having this augmented help really helps support the logistics that we need to uh, help get the mission done. For these guys, it's a really good opportunity for them to get away from their daily grind in the office or wherever they're working and they get to learn a valuable skill from us and they get to apply that to help support the 4th Fighter Wing SEER program. It's time for Club of the Week. The idea behind the Gay Straight Alliance was to create a healthy support network for any LGBT member who ends up getting stationed at Seymour Johnson Air Force Base. We are going to take a comprehensive approach at things like safety, education, history, personal growth, activism, volunteerism, also integrating our heterosexual allies. For more information, you can reach us on our Facebook at SJGSA. That's all for this edition of Strike Eagle News. For more information on base events and mission-related info, visit our website at seymourjohnson.af.mil or check us out on social media. Have a great day, Team Seymour, and we'll see you next week.